got some leadership duties this week. How's that going? Yeah, it's going well so far. Um, it's been helped out with uh, the likes of Kirby Mile and James Downs and that, so enjoying it and it's going really well. Exeter last weekend picked a, a 19 year old skipper as well, so it's sort of a common thread, really, isn't it? Yeah, it looks like he's trying to build the youngsters up and um, bring them through and develop them as players, so it's a good opportunity for me and for that guy who played last week as well, so building us up and then uh, give us more confidence as a player and later on into into our career, really. And these are the kind of things you have to do, even something like speaking to us um, as part of a leadership role. It, it's much wider than just you know running onto the field these days. When rugby finishes, you've got better opportunities and you're more confident, really, in talking in front of people, so it's, uh, it's a good opportunity, so happy. How are you finding being a senior player now compared to an under 20 or you know, someone who's just sort of in and out of the academy last season the season before? It's going really well at the moment I think the season we've had uh, so far has been uh, a bit up and down I think I think it can be better but for me personally is uh, just trying to plug away and keep going and training well and play, uh, trying to play as often as I can really. Uh, you played against the Ospreys didn't you? How did that go? Yeah it was a uh, a diff- it was a difficult game for us. We were uh, on the back foot quite a lot and we couldn't really get into the game. So for me, it was hard. I didn't really get much of the ball and get, be able to get much influence on the game, really. So I was disappointed with that. But that's just the way the game goes, really. Uh, tell us a bit. I mean, you know, we've seen you in the 20s. Where are you from? What's your background? Where do, you know, How have you ended up here? Uh, well, I'm from Pont I've played for them since I was a little kid and come up through. You're a proper Ponty boy. Yeah, my, yeah, I played for them. Uh, my father played, and my grandfather played as well. So it's really embedded in me, really. Um, so I come up through there, and then got picked up the under 16s, and come through the academy, and then in under 18s and the 20s uh, caps as well. And then come up into the first team played two years ago uh, for my first season. Really, must be a, there's a group of you now who will be getting opportunity this weekend and this competition, a group of boys that you all know each other quite well, a similar age group? Yeah, we all come through together really, so it's the likes of Dylan, Dylan Lewis, Jared Evans, Liam Belcher, so we've all come played under 18s together in the 16s and the 20s, so we got we, we know each other, we play off each other as well and uh, nice to play along with mates as well. So. Jared has looked slicked when, he, when he's come on. Um, he's looked pretty decent, doesn't he? Yeah, Jared's the uh, type of player. He can change the game. He's uh, bring something different to the party. He can create something from nothing sometimes, and you just make that break. And uh, lately, he's been playing really well, and he's looking really sharp. Exeter. What about them? They're one of the top teams in the Premiership, really, and they so it's going to be a tough game. Um, they can be physical, as most Premiership teams are, really. So. Uh, Get us younger boys now trying to uh, mentally get ready for the game and the challenges coming.